name is Anika Salvi and I will be presenting to you how to save Mother Earth. Problems our planet is facing. Air pollution due to industries, vehicles, and global warming through greenhouse gases. Water pollution due to chemical sewage disposal and water wastage. Overpopulation causing stress on natural resources. How are these problems bad for us? Air pollution can cause coughing, eye, and skin irritation or cancer. Global warming is heating up the world, which is melting the ice in the North and South Poles, causing floods. Water pollution can affect human and animal health, and water wastage can lead to droughts and agriculture loss. We are running out of non-renewable sources, and not a lot of countries have switched to renewable energy yet. Air pollution. Air pollution can be hazardous to health because we breathe in the air, but you can prevent it by using an electric car because 75% of the world's pollution comes from cars, and by using an electric car, since it makes less pollution than normal cars, it would benefit our environment. Avoid using plastic bags because 99% of the plastic in the world have fossil fuels in it, which has deadly air pollutants in it because it releases the chemicals and then it could cause health problems. Don't unnecessarily waste electricity because most mechanisms to generate electricity release carbon dioxide, which is a greenhouse gas that causes global warming. Plant more trees because it converts carbon dioxide into oxygen to purify the air, but it's getting cut down and the pollution levels are rising, so we need to plant more trees. Water pollution. Water is an important resource for humans and other living things, but it is limited, so we need to protect it. We could dispose waste the right way. Never dispose something that isn't biodegradable down the drain. Otherwise, it'll go to lakes and streams, and if any human drinks it, they'll get poisoned. Conserve water as much as possible. If you don't, there would be more severe droughts. Do not litter pollutants that can enter water supply, which means that if you litter, then it could go into drains and then clog them and then cause floods. Population stress on resources. Many people still use non-renewable energy, which is running out because it is fossil-based. The best way to solve this problem is to switch to renewable energy such as solar energy or using energy from wind turbines or hydroelectric turbines. If you use non-renewable energy, don't unnecessarily waste it. Consume only what is necessary to get your job done. Such as, for example, you could turn off the lights when not in use or turn off the air conditioner whenever it's not needed. These are some ways you can save Mother Earth. So what are you waiting for? Let's go and make the world a better